Hello Glass Industry, it's Mark from Glass Open Book and today I would like to talk about our favorite topics of digitalization and digital transformation. To understand what digital transformation is, we need to start with the very beginning – digitization. Digitization is the transfer from analog to digital. We do not use pen and paper to do business anymore. We digitize data. Digitalization is another term which means everything mentioned above plus how we use digitized data. It allows us to improve our workflow by making it faster and better as the data is super easy to access and work with. And finally, digital transformation. It is the integration of digital technology into all areas of business, resulting in fundamental changes on how business works and deals with customers. Although you may find some other definitions of digital transformation, but this one is the most general one. Because the definition can sometimes seem to be too broad and meaningless, some people tend to underestimate the importance of digitalization and digital transformation. That is why it is so important to understand what this is and why so many giants, especially glass manufacturers, are going for it. In this video, I will not only explain how digitalization is transforming manufacturing globally, but also specify what exactly smart manufacturing or Industry 4.0 is and examine the productivity impacts that digitalized manufacturing promises to deliver. And after that, I have some great, great solutions for you. So, watch till the end. The digitalization of manufacturing is changing how products are designed, fabricated, used and serviced, just as it's transforming the operations, processes, energy footprint of factories and supply chains. In the glass factory environment, Industry 4.0 refers to the use of sensors and software in production machinery and equipment to enable a real-time flow of information about the operational status, conditions of the equipment or the final product. With the mass, devices are essentially enriched with embedded computing that allows them to interact and communicate with one another. Companies are likely to see significant improvements in operational efficiencies as intelligent devices connect machines on many different factory floors across the supply chain. Germany's Academy of Science and Engineering has produced an Industry 4.0 Maturity Index, which describes six stages of digital transformation, which are computerization, connectivity, visibility, transparency, predictive capacity and adaptability. These steps chart the evolution of company capabilities from simple digitalization, like adopting computers and connecting them online, to being able to collect data to understand what is happening and why in real time on the factory floor, to reaching a point of anticipating and predicting whether for machine faults or changes in demand that will affect orders to self-optimizing factories in which autonomous responses can be achieved. It is important to keep in mind, though, that a wide range of enterprise-level researches show that the benefits of digitalization are best realized when digital investments are combined with organizational adjustments. The adoption of new digital manufacturing technologies can generate meaningful productivity impacts for the companies that successfully integrate these technologies into their operations. The majority of value, from 80 to 90 percent, created in prior industrial revolutions came from replacing old machines with the new ones. However, nowadays it is not necessarily about replacing existing machines, but rather equipping them with sensors that collect and software that processes data, so those machines can be used more effectively and productively as enterprises will be equipped with needed information to facilitate better decision-making. Even without machinery replacement, digital technologies will enable productivity gains and new business models. 
Numerous reports assess the use of sensors and software solutions to increase manufacturing productivity by 10 to 25% with the potential to create as much as $1.8 trillion in the new value per year across the world's factories by 2025. Aside from the productivity improvements, digitalization of manufacturing promises from 10 to 25% improvement in labor efficiency and energy saving of 10 to 20 percent. Obviously, the impact of software and sensor solutions facilitate predictive and preventive factory equipment maintenance and reduce factory equipment maintenance costs by up to 40 percent. All right, enough of numbers. They look sweet, but Mark, show me the real solution that can lead me to that figures. Luckily, on Glass Open Book we have the company that offers just such solutions. And this company is called Vertec. The company has been in business since 1995, which is a lot for a software provider company. Their system is called SEAL, and it provides manufacturers with very precise real-time KPIs on the performance of the whole plant. Thanks to all this shared data and full traceability of products, production rates improve, losses decrease and customer risk are reduced. Seal can be installed from the batch to the politizer through mold shop and quality labs. The system is currently developed for glass makers producing various containers in hollowware, tableware, tubes and decorating glass. To tell you more about it and answer important questions, I will call Ula Stopal, who is the CEO at Vertac. Hello, Ulas. How are things going in Vertec? Yeah, thank you very much, Mark. We are fine. Uh, everything is going on. I hope that uh, it's the same for you uh, in the UK. Yes. So in France, we, we strive to do our best. And I hope uh, the same for you, Mark. Thank you. Thank you for joining this call, first of all. And yes, I've been working on the video on the topic of digitalization of glass production. And Vertec company clearly stands out on Glass.org platform with your SIL systems. And that's why I decided to give you a call, uh, because no one else would tell us better about SIL and your products. So, uh, could you please tell me what does SIL actually mean? Sure. So, SIL stands for Online Information System. In French, Système d'Information sur Ligne. SIL is the company trademark and refers to the whole supervision system developed by Vertec. The system is made of several modules and 300 plus features that all complement one another. Okay, and could you tell me more about uh, these modules? There are several of them, right? Right. The system is made of five modules, complementary to each other. These are SILPROD, SIL 4.0, SILEXQUAL, Silex Mode and Silex Manager. SILPROD, for instance, gathers data all along the production lines and display them in real time on SIL station at both hot and cold ends. SIL 4.0 allows manufacturers to gather data in real time throughout the glass plant and use this data to analyze the current situation and foresee the future. Silex Qual is the must-have tool for managing quality control across not only raw materials, but also articles and palettes. Silex Mold contains a certain amount of information on each mold and provides the real-time status. When a mold is removed from the IS machine and requires repair, the mold shop operator can view its full repair history. This makes the repairs faster and more effective, significantly minimizes the risk of lacking available molds and provides all the necessary information for mold profitability assessments. And finally, Silex Manager is designed for managers in charge of the planning of new productions, the quality control procedures, and preparing new set molds. This module is also in an indispensable platform for performing analysis, enabling both the extraction of data 
and also the generation of reports. Wow, great. The system seems to be huge, right? Correct. <laughs> um, and speaking of every software product, I've seen that you have customers all over the world and I assume there should be a support of some foreign languages. And what languages does SEAL currently support? So in our system, there are 19 languages currently available in the system. Obviously, all the major ones like English, French, Italian, German, Spanish, Portuguese, Chinese, Russian and so on. I see. And what if there is no language that I need in the system? Are there any options? Yes, in this case, if the language you need is not included in the SEAL, you have two solutions. The first one consists in letting us taking care of the translation. This is a service provided by Vertec. Or we can transfer you the files in English language and then you will be in charge of the translations. Hmm, that's convenient. That's convenient, very. I uh, also speaking about software products, I can imagine there should be updates. And how often do you make these updates? We do a major update each year to ensure the stability and security of the system as the seal is based on a versioning policy. While preparing for this video, I named a lot of numbers on how software products uh, really, really help to improve the efficiency and productivity of glass plants. Are there any figures on the efficiency or energy consumption improvements from those customers who use SEAL? Yeah, so the, the SEAL system helps to reduce your energy consumption and thus your environment, environmental impact. When you use the SEAL during the year, you can save up to 7% of your energy consumption. It's huge. Yes. Data supervision, adjustments of your production settings, and compare your outputs allow you to take a step towards a smart factory. We do have some customer improving by 5% the pack to melt within eight months. Great, great. I, th I think that uh, using seal is something that is essential for every plant to, to call themselves sustainable production, right? Yes, right. I also know that the software alone is, is nothing without the sensors. And does Vertec provide any hardware to support the, the system? Yes, Mark, we do. We deliver the hardware needed for the system. However, the plant is responsible for the wiring and the cabling of the local network. We can't take these responsibilities. And the plant uses our cabling specifications giving just after the technical visit. For instance, we provide our own data acquisition cabinet named SILAC. This is an industrial PC that receives all the signals from the sensors online and transfer them to the servers. We also provide our own developed thin client named SIL client. This is a small size terminal perfect, perfectly adapted to the SIL workstations. In addition to the SIL client and SILAC, Vertec can also provide other materials such as monitor, keyboard, mouse, MOXA interface, cabinet with air conditioner, server, licenses, and also LED display. So while discussing the order, we defined with you all the hardware you need for the whole seal installation. It Great. works like that. Great, a whole package, a whole package, very convenient. But still, I believe that most companies are skeptical about trying digital solutions. And I wonder how, how do you persuade your clients to, to try digital solutions on their plants? And how long does it take them uh, to get used to using this software? Yeah, so Mark, as you said, uh, digitalization is the key to moving towards a more efficient, intelligent and connected factory. Basically, the customer is already convinced. However, installing an MES system brings a lot of changes in the plant. The main strength of Vertec is the 25-year know-how. We do have the skill to follow the customer during the management change. All our customers see a payback in less a year thanks to a user-friendly HIM, a common platform for all the modules, the reactivity of operators, performing quick job change for the hotend operators, 
corrective actions when some problem appears, checking history in order to assure the future, setting the correct parameters of the machines, traceability of the products, mold repairs, quality controls, conformity of the palettes which are delivered, and finally anticipation. And all together, we are able to install the system within three months. Wow, these advantages even convinced myself to, <laughs> to, try, <laughs> to try the software. Okay, and my, my final question would be, uh, what would you recommend to the companies in the future? So, my main recommendation is to start the project as soon as possible. Every day is a lack of improvement, as the results are guaranteed. Faster the projects start, smoother the management change transition will be, and quicker the plant will see the benefits of the system. The most important is that the customers should not feel alone. We will be helping them and following the project with them all together. Mark, as you said previously, Vertec has a strong experience in management change and prove it so far. Yes, that's a wise advice. That's a wise advice. So, Ulas, thank you. Thank you for giving us uh, some minutes of this amazing conversation. And yes, we wish you all the best. And personally, I look forward to seeing more and more useful products from uh, Vertec, useful systems. And yes, keep, keep, keep in this space. And yeah, we are always here for you and <laughs> for our further cooperation. Thank you, Mark. We do appreciate a lot. And thank you for giving us this opportunity. And uh, I hope that it will also motivate others to do the same. Yeah, it was a pleasure. It was a pleasure. It was thank a pleasure you. for us too. Thank you for your time. Have thank a nice you. day. Have a nice day. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Huge thank you to Vertec and everyone who was involved in making this video possible. Feel free to write down in the comments about your attitude towards digitalization of glass production. I would be glad to hear your opinion. Until the next time, goodbye.